putting the bullshit aside Who wants to go for a ride? We going out for the night Yeah, we going out for the night I'm only here for the vibes Only here for the good times Come and jump into my ride Yeah, we going out for the night What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy, Old Meezy. It's your boy, Ace. And we are the Gomez Brothers. Yeah. Thank you for clicking on the video. So, I don't know if this is real. You think it's real? I don't know. Could be real, could be AI, because this AI shit's getting really good there and was, scary. There was talk that he was supposed to be dropping now soon. Who knows? I don't know. But why, like, why would it be I don't know. this random channel? You know what I mean? Yeah, it is random as fuck. Jayco did that with the volumes, yeah. random channels. I don't know why they do that, but it, yeah. it could be real. And if it is, we hear for it. Yeah, we're going to break gonna, it down like it is real. And then if it is real, is Drake the one that wrote it? That's another th That's why I don't want even want to get into it with him because there's so much shit. Like, is he the one that even wrote it? Yeah. That's I don't know. Or did he actually get back true. in his Jimmy bag? I don't know. You know what I mean? Uh, but yeah, so it's called Drop and Give Me 50. Push-ups. Yeah. I could do fitty clip right now. I'm excited, man. I'm I ain't not gonna lie. going to because we're in the middle of a black void and there's no floor to do yeah. it on. We're floating in midair right now. That's floating. why I can't do it. But if this is real, it's going to be crazy because yeah. everybody, oh, J. Cole. We made a whole video explaining how J. Cole's still the goat and why you should leave him alone and love him anyway. Yes, facts. He's a shit. <laughs> so go watch yeah, that video. That video will pop up at the end of this video, so just stick around to the end if you want to see it. Uh, but man, let's just, let's see. Let's see if it's real, I guess. Because this AI shit's crazy, man. I don't know anything can happen. But the views are going up crazy, so. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. I don't know. We're going to find out. And if it, if it is really real, this is actually an exciting it's moment exciting, to be yeah, a YouTuber. For sure. So I, that's it. Uh, I'm going for hip hop too, man. Facts. If you are new here, welcome aboard. I go by Music God. I'm a rapper, singer, songwriter myself. I got a new EP dropping on my birthday, April 25th on all platforms. Definitely stick around for that. Links are down below if, uh, so you can follow the Spotify, all that. And uh, we got his YouTube channel right here. Yeah. And you can go follow that right there if you're into anime. It's the guy. That's the guy going over there. Has yeah. to spend some time with him over there. It's so absolutely that's pretty much it man let's hop into this i'm excited so drizzy drake drizzy drake rogers it's been a while since it's been <laughs> called out huh you up let's get it go yeah gonna... oh oh these are already look i could never be nobody number one fan your first number one i had to put it in your hand Ooh. What was that? What was that Poetic Justice? Or yeah, did they have a song before that? One, I had to put it in your hand. Did they have a song before Poetic okay. Justice? No, I think I think that was it. That damn. Yeah, because people, was it? people, I, I think people were saying that if it wasn't for Drake, like mm. you know, it wouldn't have been as big. Because that was on Good Kid, Mad City, right? I believe so. Yeah. Now we're gonna find this out because if these facts are real, then that's giving more validity to the. Did I say yeah. that right? Validity, yeah. yeah validity yeah, to yeah. the song if it's real or not. Yeah. What is Kendrick Lamar's first number one hit? Ding, ding, ding. It was humble. His first one. So that's a lie. Let's see. I don't know. Why you be lying, Google? Anyway, let's get into it. Your first number one, I had to put it in your hand. You pussies can't get put outside America for man. I'm out in Tokyo hey, man, because I'm big in mm -hmm. Japan. I'm a hit maker, y'all depend on. Tough on record in my city, Damn. it was friends on. Mm. You won't never take no chain off of us. How the fuck? He said, I'm the hit maker, y'all depend on, though. Yeah. That's yeah. kind of fire. And, like... The whole time I've been talking down on Drake because just because it's the the big three. But other than that, like obviously Drake's Drake, you know what I mean. But he does make hits. He said yeah, we depend sure. on his hits. Everybody knows that he makes hits. A summer, everybody's like, damn, second summer without Tory Lanez is crazy. Imagine summers without Drake, though, you know? Yeah. That'd be kind of crazy, too. So, I don't know. Let's get it. Big stepping with a size seven man's on. Big stepping. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> Mason Morales in a big stepping. He said, you yeah. big stepping with a size, size seven man. men's on. Isn't Kendrick short? Yeah. I don't know how tall he is, but. Tough on record in my city. Drake's like 6'2, though. You won't never take no chain off of us. Oh, that one too. That, uh, that never, never take no chain off of us. That's a direct uh, response to like that when he was like, um, "I'm snatching chains and burning tattoos." It's up. Oh, okay. Yeah, when Kendrick said, "I'm snatching chains and burning tattoos," he just said, "You never snatch no chains." Mm -hmm. So that's a direct response to like that. All right. So caught that. Hell yeah. Big 
big in Japan. I'm the hit maker, y'all depend on. Tough on record in my city, it was brand zone. Mm. You won't never take no chain off of us. How the fuck you been stepping with a size seven man zone? Mm. This the bark with the bike, nigga, what's up? I know what's my up? picture on the wall when y'all cook up. Mm. Yeah, extortion, Man. baby, hope for real, you been shook up. This top, so you drop and give me 50 like some push ups. Huh, top. Your last one, brick. You really not on shit. Wait, top they dog is his label, right? Top, yeah, I think. Yeah. Is it tops or top dog or whatever? Yeah. Because I read one of the comments under this video. It said top dog owns like 50% of Kendrick's publishing or some shit. Yeah. That's crazy. That's kind of a corny bar, but if you understand like the behind the scenes of distributing and shit, like the splits is when yeah. if you're on a feature with an artist, you got to split the royalties. And he's like, you've just been splitting this whole time. I guess he's saying, I don't know. Uh, it was a corny like punchline yeah, but it, I get, but it I get what, he's, what he's trying yeah. to say is hard so I de- yeah let's get it it's loose for you cause they hate to see me lit put your contract cause we gotta see the split mm-hmm. and the way you doing splits bitch your pants might rip you or maybe he's talking up. about the split between Top Dog and him he's he's he said pull the contract yeah. we gotta see the split oh the okay. oh, that makes it. more sense damn really not on shit they make excuses for you cause they hate to see me lit put your contract cause we gotta see the split and the way you doing splits bitch your pants might rip mm-hmm. You ain't in no big three. So that's, I mean, it, it kind of sounds real. Look who he, no, it doesn't. Look who he just named. He said SZA, 21 Savage, and who? Travis Scott. He said SZA got you wiped down. Travis Scott meaning, got you wiped down. And fucking... Meaning they're better than Kendrick? Yeah. They're, yeah. He's saying they can have the third spot instead of over Kendrick. SZA... Travis Scott and Twenty One Savage. I think he's. I think he's talking in terms of like. Or is he using them as examples to say how trash he is? Because that's the only way I'll accept that bar. Because no, they cannot yeah. have that spot. Yeah, no. But I, he's probably talking in terms of like making the most hits. I think that's what I'm thinking. Because Travis Scott's answer is that they make hits. They like, you know what I mean? Well, it's ain't a hit battle. Yeah, it's a fucking battle battle. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Jeez Louise, I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. 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 Let's
<laughs> I don't know, bro. It sounds real. It, it, does, it sounds it real. Does. Big difference between Mike then and Mike now. What the fuck is this a 20 V1, nigga? What's a prince to a king? He a son, nigga. Mm. I get more love in the city that you from, nigga. Mm. Metro, shut your Delphi? whole ass up and make some drugs, nigga. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, I'm Metro. a six guy. Mm. I'm a front runner. Y'all nigga manage your chubs, little blunt runner. Mm. Playing the six and your, your boys ain't even come from it. He said your manager was Chubb's little blunt runner. <laughs> That's crazy. But it's shit like that. It's like See, little insight insides, shit like that. Yeah. That maybe. If we won't that's, if that's yeah. true, you know what I mean. So I don't we know. won't know because that's inside stuff. Right. You know? We we know he's been talking about Chubb since day one. Yeah. Um, but he said your manager was Chubb's little blunt runner. Hey, you gotta start somewhere, bro. You gotta get <laughs> yeah, your nice. foot in the door. If you're running blunts for this dude, and eventually you're like, hey man, I do this, I do beats and shit. Mm -hmm. Like, give me a listen, and you eventually made it to producing, like helping Kendrick out. Yeah, then you made somewhere. it. So what? Is he a Bobby the blunt runner too? So <laughs> and when you boys got rich, you had to run from it. Cash blowing, able bread, I hit tricking. Should we do for bitches? He doing for niggas. Mm. Just wish chains, wicked, wicked, wicked. Spinning like you trying to fuck while you tripping. Drizzy tripping down, probably got your bitch in there. Be hard. Got on gun, boy, don't make me have to chip in there. Yeah. Rolling mm. loud stage, y'all be turned. That was slick as hell. Lucky that your dog, little Ben, doesn't kiss and tell. Pussy kisses, man, don't tell me about no switches. I be rocking every fucking chain I own next visit. Mm. I be with some bodyguards like Whitney. Top say, try your little midget ass, better fucking. He said like Whitney, but I'll be with bodyguards like Whitney. Is that what he said? Yeah, that's what he said. I don't get that. And then he also just responded to that when y'all yeah, better come with three switches. He just said uh -huh. he's he's just said something about switches. I don't get the Whitney one. She always have like hella bodyguards or something. That's that's the only thing I could think of. Uh -huh. Yo, midget ass. <laughs> Everybody talking about his height. Who's calling him a midget? <laughs> <That's awesome. laughs> Oh, he said, you got me out here talking like I'm 50. I'm about to look up Kendrick's height right now. <laughs> I gotta know. <laughs> Why is he calling him a midget? 5'5". Five, five. He's 5'5". Five five. He's up there with Cat Williams. Kevin Hart, maybe taller than Kevin Hart. Yeah. He's calling him a midget. With Drake, like 6'2". But J. Cole, 6'4". Yeah. So, <laughs> I'm, not, I'm done bringing J. Cole up. Let's go. Like I'm 50, eh? like I'm 50. Yeah. I might take a latest girl and cuff like I'm Ricky. Ricky, he jumping in this nigga turning 50. Who turning 50? Who jumped in? What? He said, I can't believe you jumped in. This dude's turning 50. Yeah, I don't know. Who who jumped in? It can't let be. Us, let us know. It can't be J. Cole because J. Cole's about to turn 40, not 50. Yeah. Who else turning 50 that's trying to jump in? Was it was it Cameron jumping in on J. Cole shit? <laughs> I don't know. I'm reaching out. Yeah. But who the fuck? I, I don't know. Who the fuck? Like I'm 50, eh? Niggas really got me out here rapping what I live in. I might take a latest girl and cuff her like I'm Ricky. Can't believe he jumping in this nigga turning 50. Every song that made it on the chart he got from Trizzy. Worry about whatever going on with you and huh? Hey, shout out to Ooh. the whatever he busting out the gritty. I know why you mad, nigga. I ain't even tripping. Hey, shout out to Marie. I'm rapping after this. I'm way too busy. Uh -huh. It's for all the top dogs. Drop it. Give me 50. Drop it. He said, it's the only one you get. <laughs> oh, oh yeah, see? Oh, oh. Nah, bro, hold on. He's snapping right See, that, that's, that's what we were saying. You're right. Hold on, he said. Top dogs, drop it, give me 50. He keeps saying 50. That must mean something. Yeah, it has to. He keeps saying 50. Drop it, give me 50. He said. Said, you got me talking like I'm 50. He said, Why are you jumping in? He's about to be 50. This gotta mean something. Hold on. Oh, it didn't. That's what we're gonna talk about. How they actually hate each other. And yeah, that's, that's what I'm thing. saying. That's that's <laughs> that's what J. Cole was like. Yo, damn, they really don't like each other. Yeah, uh, that's a real beat. That's not the type of time I'm on. So. Yeah, facts. He, that's he said it's been brewing for a while. Yeah. It, has, it has been. Yeah. So yeah. That dot shit was weak as fuck. That was the dot shit. Hit. It has to be the like that um, verse. They said the dot shit. Uh, the only thing I could think of is you know because his name's K dot so K dot the dot sh yeah he said fuck it. Cole's talking about the dot shit was weak as fuck because Cole said uh, which one he said his first one was classic his third one was a masterpiece oh his album oh Talk maybe the dot damn how there's dots in between them oh maybe is he like there was there was this one dot. 
After Damn. It was Damn and Die on the album. Yeah. Yeah, it's an acronym. There's dots in between yeah. each letter. No, 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 no. There isn't? No. Damn it. Is there dots in Mad City? Good Kid, Mad City? No. <laughs> oh, yeah, I think there is. Hold on. I don't, there's a dot after Damn, though, on the cover. Shit. Right there, there is. That dot shit. There's, uh... Either way, it's referring to Kendrick. There's dots in between Mad... Yeah. I mean, is that what you're saying? We know the K dot, the dots in the album. Which is, what do you guys think? Which one do you think it is? Yeah. Mm. 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 He don't talk like that, but maybe he does. What just happened? Hey, they gon' give me little beats so I can freeze all on the top. Fuck it, I appreciate it, cause he know that I ain't gon' stop. I ain't gon' rock and I don't care. Oh, <laughs> oh shit. I don't know. I just hope that d down the line we don't find out it's fake and we look stupid doing this. That's just all, yeah. that's what I hope, but I don't But it is what it is. Hey. So, he gon' need to bring that demon out, cause that's not enough for K-Dot, bro. We gonna see. That's not enough. Kada still hasn't responded to what J. Cole did and said. Yeah, but so like he gonna definitely respond to this, and this is not gonna be enough. Kada gonna win. Maybe he's trying to find out still if it's real or not. <laughs> yeah, true. So, yo, somebody call Aubrey. <laughs> did you really do this? <laughs> Let me talk to Forty or Oliver, Charles, whoever you got over there. Who? There was <laughs> there was some nice little you know thing throughout the throughout oh, the track. The, it wasn't it wasn't a bad first. He would. This is more of like a, a. Is literally like trying to sun him. I think dropping yeah. give me fifty is referring to him being like uh, authoritative over him. Like yeah. I'm your sergeant. Dropping give me fifty. Shut up, because top dog owns you. Yeah. That's and, that's some ball shit. I'm not gonna lie. He did say this is not everything I know. So it kind of feels like bait as well. This is. Yeah. It feels like bait as well. This so is if battling. Kendrick, yeah, Kendrick drops his, and I feel like Jake will. Come right back with another one. This is one. battling. This is this is getting personal with it. This is not, yeah. Cause between J Cole and Kendrick, I feel like it was a battle of who can rap the best. Yeah, yeah. Was, this is a battle between like I hate you. I'm gonna yeah. throw all your dirt out and yeah. cause I hate you. Like yeah. that's a rap beat. That's more like it. Like we didn't need we didn't need all that. I mean it was fun. It was fun. Yeah. Cause cause Kendrick, I don't think Drake can rap better technically, you know, than Kendrick. No. Nah. But apparently he got some shit on him and he's. Big yeah, boss. he gonna have to, and it, he gonna have to bring the demon out because this is not enough. Kendrick, I'm telling you, when Kendrick drops his, it's gonna go crazy. Well, we'll see. And Jake's gonna have to respond to that. We shall see. And he's see. talking about 20v1. Look, apparently, Ace at Rocky, there's Drake too. Oh, we getting cruised together. <laughs> we getting cruised together. I'm just glad nobody's worried about Simba this and Cole because that's stupid. They getting Should cruised together. To that. They're getting the cruise there. We're gonna have a uh what'd you call it? The uh Marvel Endgame? Is yeah. that what it is? Is that what's going on? <laughs> is Jake Thanos? <laughs> OVO. Cause if OVO gets involved, you gotta get young money involved, and maybe Weezy will join his team, and then you got Kendrick and Eminem. We'll have Eminem versus Lil Wayne finally, right? And then it'll just be the <laughs> ultimate Thanos and Iron Man versus fucking like bro. That would be yeah. wild. Whoever's writing a script for 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 just mainstream music, let me let me Get in yeah. a meeting. I'm so this was dope. Some... Wasn't enough, but it was dope. It's... So let's see what happens from this. The beat was hard. Yeah, the beat was fire. The beat was hard. So we shall see if Definitely. it's real. Yeah. If it's not, don't laugh at us. Taking it down if it's not. I'm just yeah. Appreciate y'all being here with us. Subscribe. Yeah. See you in the next one. We going out for the night. We going out for the night.